Uh, hello. Welcome back. It's your boy, full on, and we're playing some more Amori. Um, you may notice I'm in the exact same spot I left off in the last episode. That's not a coincidence. Um, I really want to play more of this game, so I'm gonna do we're going straight into part two. We're just going straight into it. Normally I try to segment it out and kinda of, kinda of go over over the course of time, but I, I'm really digging this game so far. So we're just we're just gonna keep on going, man. I'm I'm a little I'm a little obsessed, not gonna lie. So we're just gonna gonna head right on in. Let's go to Basil's house. Psst. Hey. Psst. You Yeah, you over there. Um Mori? I think that mailbox is talking to us. Maybe we should go check it out? Okay. Yes, yes! Hello, valued customer! Welcome to my shop! Please buy something! <laughs> oh my god, I hate it. Um, alright, well, what do you got? What'd you like to buy? We can buy some candy. 30, heals 30 heart. Heals 25 juice! Yo, wait a minute, juice is a, is a resource? Oh, I guess that's mana, health and mana, okay. Deals small damage to all foes and reduces their speed. Jax, and then present. It's not what you wanted, inflicts anger on a friend or foe, aww. That's really sad. Um, you know what? I think I will buy some candy. I would like two of them. But it'll be 20 clams. Thank you kindly. And... God, you can't say you kindly anymore. After, after Bioshock, it, it freaks me out. Um... You know what? Let's get let's get some apple juice as well. Apple juice would be expensive, but you know, with uh, with Cook Lord, probably worth it to be able to refill his juice so he can juice up some cooking for us. All right, train station, Pinwheel Forest, Basil. Dude, Basil's house has its own sign. That's pretty sweet. Yo, let's let that the train station though. Oh no! Wait, Amori, we're supposed to go to my house. It's just past the path south of the playground. I finished planting some little sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. All right, so this is probably what's gonna happen on the right, but I have to check and make sure anyway, because that's just how I am. What? What is this? It's like a little bus stop? A transportation station. Doesn't seem to be in service. Okay, I'm assuming that, yeah, okay. We're supposed to go to my house, yep. Just making sure, just making sure. You never know. Down we go. Oh, what a nice little garden you've got here, Basil. Watering can. These are sunflowers. They're called that because they always face towards the sun. That's how I want to be like. Someone who always sees the bright side of things. That's sweet. And what are these? These flowers are called Lily of the Valley. It's said that they are able to ward off evil spirits and help people see a brighter future. I guess that's why they remind me of Mari. I can always count on her to help me stay positive. Um, turnip boy? Whoa! What's that ugly plant creature? Don't you know, Kel? That's a sprout mole. Sprout moles are highly intelligent creatures, but become dangerously vicious when they are lost. Please, Mr. Sprout Mole, stop that! You're stomping all over the flowers, or over all the flowers. Does he talk? Oh, okay, that's just rude. Oh, Jesus! Uh, it looks like the Sprout Mole is angry. Like us, Sprout Moles are also feel emotions. Since the Sprout Mole is angry, its attack is higher. But on the other hand, it lowers its defense. So we're saying is now is the perfect time to strike. Come on, Amori, let's do this. All right, well, let's just get him. Let's just mess him up. Got bad news for you, Mr. Sprout Mole. You shouldn't have swung first. We oh, bumped into Hero. How, why is everyone hitting on my man Hero? Yeah, get out of here. Mori's party was victorious. Gained 22 XP. Three clams? This dude was freaking, he had nothing. Mori grew to level two. Heck yeah. Uh, most of the flowers are unharmed. That's a relief. And we killed that Sprout Mole, I guess. We just murdered it. Hey, Amori. Now that we're getting the hang of battling, here's a journal where we can keep track of any neat foes we come across. Hero gave you the Faux Facts journal. There. Now it's in your pocket. The journal is yours to record with, but we might pitch in sometimes too. Check it out through your pocket in the player menu by pressing X. 
Oh, oh my lord, look at this. Yo, they got no XP from the first battle because they died, because they were toasted, man. Oh, I can equip. Can I equip the knife? No, it auto-equipped. That's why I couldn't leave without it. Uh, also, can we talk about how I'm I'm fighting with a fucking knife? Wait a minute. <laughs> like, wait a minute. The school bully shows up and he's like, I'm gonna body slam you. And, and Amori was like, I'm gonna stab you, bitch. <laughs> it's hella fucked up. What does everyone use? Stuffed toy. Mr. Plan Egg makes a weird noise when you punch it. I don't like that. What do you use, Kel? A rubber ball. Playground tested. Child approved. He throws a dodgeball at you. Okay. And Hero uses a spatula. Good for flipping burgers. Yo, he's got a part-time job. Making burgers. I respect it, man. Um, so if I go to options, that's just actual options. Oh, in pocket. Pocket, of course. Important. Fofax. Use. Lost Sprout Mole. Dangerous and hostile, ugly plant creature. It says it's smart, but do not believe it. It is not, and it smells like dirty laundry. Aww. That's very rude. Okay. Well, oh, whoops. What do these flowers say? Nothing? Well, now I'm gonna stomp on the flowers. What do you feel about that one, Basil? <laughs> Got him. What are these? These are roses. Can you guess who they remind me of? They remind me of Hero. Did you guess correctly? Roses come in many different colors and have their own unique meanings. Pink roses symbolize, symbolize admiration. Orange roses symbolize passion. Yellow roses symbolize friendship. And the list goes on. Hero doesn't remind me of any rose in particular. I think Hero is like all roses because he's versatile and universally loved. Aww. Ah! These are the type of- these are a type of flower called- These are a type of flower called the glad- Gladulus? I don't know flowers, I'm sorry. The gladio what? Gladiolus, also known as the sword flower. As you might guess, they represent strength of character. Someone who is honest with strong moral values. Someone who stands by their convictions. Gladiolus reminds me of Aubrey because she's always true to herself. Oh, I see. So what you're saying is that Aubrey is really stubborn. Hey, no I'm not. <laughs> okay, let's move on. <laughs> Yo, getting called out. Oh, well, here we go. Oh no, not again. Please, Mr. Sprout Mole, stop twirling. You're destroying all the flowers. This is where we get introduced to all the different emotions. See, there was angry, and now we're dealing with this one. Oh, I see. This Sprout Mole is happy. In that case, it has a higher chance to hit our weak spots and do more damage. But it also means it has a higher chance of missing. Okay, so higher crit, lower actual um, hit chance. Easy. Um, hello? Miss. Oh my god, hit right in the heart, bruh. Just take him out, man. Throw the dodgeball at him, hit him with the eggplant. And then uh, get him with the spatula. Dwap. Slain. Gained 18 XP, four clams. Dude, these Sproutmoles ain't got no cash, man. They'd be very poor. Hmm. We seem to be running across a lot of foes with emotion. In case you didn't know, emotions can determine how strong or weak an attack is. Happy beats angry. Angry beats sad. And sad beats happy. Okay, so there's a... Alright, got it. Here, I even drew a guide on how they work. I'm no artist, but I think you'll get the point. I'll put it in your pocket so you can check it out later. You got an emotion chart. You want to look at the emotion chart now? I would love to, thank you. Yo, look at that, <laughs> and everyone's different. Oh my god, okay, so Kel is happy, Hero is sad, and um, Aubrey is angry in this. All right, so happy you get luck and speed up, but lower hit rate. Angry you get attack up, defense down. Sad you get defense up, speed down. Some damage to heart is turned into juice. Interesting. And then there's neutral, okay. Or no, instead of taking damage to heart, you take it to, instead of health, you take it to mana? Is that what that means? Whoa, what are these flowers called? They're all cool and spiky. Actually, Kel, this is a cactus. It's more of a plant than a flower. And it's funny you ask because they remind me of you. Is it because he's a prick? Wow! <laughs> you can't be saying that shit, you're a kid. Hey, well... That, too, but mostly because cacti are very sturdy and resilient plants by nature. 
They don't need much care and can survive in even seemingly impossible conditions. I guess what I'm saying is that even you could take care of a cactus, Kel. Whoa, neat! Cacti are awesome! And then the last one. Ah, these are white tulips. Plain, simple, and bulbous, just like a Mori. I don't know, I just think it's cute. There's not much to say about me. All right, yikes. Protagonist syndrome. Ah, not another sprout mole. It's all good, Basil. We got the hang of this by now. We're experts at murdering these things. Oh, but he's sad. Hmm, the sprout mole seems a bit sad. See how it's curled up in the fetal position? Oh, That means it won't do as much damage as normal, but it'll also take less damage to heart and will lose juice instead. How sad. Let's put it out of its misery. Oh my god, this is messed up, dude. Like, I don't... These things are kind of people, too. Okay, so some of the damage goes to mana instead. All right. Interesting. Yo, why do I have less juice? Is it because I leveled up? Maybe? rolling around. Well, I guess we're just gonna take him out. Dude, you get a pretty, pretty beefy defense bonus for being sad, man. In the game, not not in real life. Don't don't take these as gospel. It's zero, yikes. Heavy, yikes. There we go. Lori's party was victorious. 14 XP, two clams. I'll regroup. Oh, everyone leveled up. Cool. And learn massage. Dude, Hero's getting all the skills. Wait a minute. Oh, and then we're just, we're not going to talk about that one. So what does Massage do? At first, reduce, acts first, reducing damage taken for one turn. Oh, that's guard. I'm stupid. Removes a friend's or foe's emotion. Okay, that's cool. So heroes are support. Got it. Understood. I don't really know how this is going to go between these, the other ones, but we'll see. We'll learn as we go on. Hero seems like a rock star, though. Right off the bat. He's he's a real hero. <laughs> First time here. How'd you get all the way up here? Hi, everyone. You all came just in time for a lovely picnic. Feel free to rest here. Everything's already all set up, and I even brought some fruit. That's nice. I would love some fruit. Thank you, Mari. Ah, yes. Some delicious fruits. Would you like to eat some? I would love to eat some. Thank you. You and your friends feel like new. Munch, munch, munch. Woohoo! Thanks, Mari! You're the best! Oh, it's nothing. I'm just trying to look out for all of you. Oh, Mari. I wish I could be more like you. You always seem to have everything under control. It's not true at all. It just seems that way from the outside. Either way, you seem to make everything look easy. Or you sure seem to make everything look easy. Yes, I agree. Mari is so effortlessly graceful. Oh, and then she does a spin. Don't you think so, Amori? Uh, yeah, I agree. Oh, I guess I have to believe it a little bit if all of you think so. My house is right down this way. Are we all ready to go? I'm ready when you are. We'll catch you later, Mari. Let me know if you need anything. See you soon. Yo, but do we make flower crowns again if we go to the picnic? I would love to have a picnic with my friends. Just have a nice little, nice little picnic. No, we're, we're singing. She's playing something, it looks like. Mari's dancing. I'm just, we're just chilling, just hanging out, man. Kel's having a nice little nap back there, it looks like. Okay, okay. Well, let's go ahead and save also. I would like to save, thank you. Oh, excuse me, I would indeed like to overwrite the file. And away we go. Dude, why is your house so freaking far away, dude? Oh, that's not good. Oh, okay, we're just not... Oh, my lord. Um, hello? <laughs> oh, he's huge! He's got a big old mustache! Well, um... Hmm. I don't really want to make him sad. I'd rather just hit him. Ye old sprout. I mean, it feels like just kind of attacking is the best thing I can do right now. I don't really need to mess with the emotion triangle yet, I feel. 
because things just kind of die real quick. We'll see how much, like, actual health he has after slamming on him a bit. The old sprout rolls over. Everyone took four damage. All right. Oh, Hero took six, and Kel took six as well. How much health you at? Oh my god, okay. So we need him to take more damage. Um, okay, so hit him. Pep talk makes people happy, right? Yeah, I don't want to do that. Um, I want to make him... Oh no, Aubrey still attacks. I want to annoy him. I would like to annoy the Sprout. And get him. Oh, he do be hitting him with the Haze. Yeah, there we go. That's the damage we're looking for. Oh, that was even less than the last one. <laughs> um, excuse me, I was winning? Oh man, this fight is pretty tough. But don't worry, we can do this if we work together. It looks like I'm gonna have to teach you all a little bit about teamwork. Let's try again, Amori. We'll get him this time. Excuse me, I made you angry? You notice anything different, Amori? You should see a new bar at the bottom of the screen with a number on the side. This is our collective energy. By using our energy, we can defeat this foe together. Just attack and you'll see. Okay. Got him. Just, just swing at him, I guess. Oh! Attack again, trip. A pass to Aubrey. Yo! Okay, this is cool. Wait a minute. This is pretty sick. Uh, look at Hero. Oh, oh, I can't. Oh, because I used it already, I see. That's pretty sweet. Okay, okay. Did you see the bubbles that popped up when we attacked? That's called a follow-up. After you attack for a limited time, you can use energy to form a follow-up move. Just press any direction arrow and see what happens. Any directional arrow and see what happens. Yeah, all right, so let's just, let's give him a go. Um, attack again. I can just go again. That's for Redis's blade, Jesus. All right, now I don't have any energy anymore. So he passes. She looks at what does what does hero do? He calls them. Okay. It's kind of messed up that I like trip him. Whew, man, this guy is really tough. When he attacked us, did you notice that our energy went up? When we take damage, we also gain energy. Okay, think of it as a chance to make a comeback. Got it. All right. Well, let's just keep wailing on him, I guess. I mean, he doesn't really do that much damage. I could release energy at some point. That's horrifying. Let's let's see what Aubrey says. Uh, look at Hero. Aubrey looked at Hero. Don't let your guard down. I'll do my best. Oh, she got buffed. Yo. Okay. So we can get free emotion buffs that way. Got it. Nice. We're full of energy. This is the perfect time to use our special attack. Amori, after you attack, press down to release energy. I hope you're all ready. Come on, everyone, let's show this big guy what we're made of. All right, well, let's just get him. Release energy, hit him with the ult, ult um, yo, wait a minute. Oh, I'm holding the fucking knife in that, man. What on earth? <laughs> Bruh, 300 damage, excuse me? 50 clams! He was rich! Leveled up and learned stab! Oh my god, dude! Amori, you are not okay, my man! Everyone's got all these happy moves like pep talk and, you know, oh, I annoy him! I can cook you a nice meal! Amori fucking stabs a bitch, dude! It's terrifying! We need to talk about this. We need to have a nice chat. And there you have it. Heroes Battle Tutorial 101. And I'm sure that as we fight more battles, our teamwork will improve over time. Wow, you guys, that was so amazing. Ah, that was nothing. <laughs> I'm taking out way bigger guys than that. I should teach you some of my skills one of these days. I like how to annoy people. Basil, I know you're not the type that likes to fight, but it's good to know how to defend yourself too. You know, I've actually been working on a book about all about battles. Maybe we can all study together next time. I'll give it I'll give it to Amori to hold on to for now. You got self-help guide. As we get stronger, I'll be updating the follow-up section of the self-help guide, so be sure to check it out every now and then. 
Amori, you should know, when we gain XP and level up, sometimes we'll also learn skills. Skills are powerful and have a wide range of effects, but each of us can only remember up to four skills at a time. After you learn a new skill, don't forget to equip it from the player menu, okay? Yeah, yeah, we know. Can we go to Basil's house now? Okay, that's all I had to say. Patience, Kel. In we go. Let's see what let's see what Basil's place is. Oh, he's got a he's got a freaking shoe house. That's pretty cool. We live in a in a tree, but Basil lives in a big old shoe, man. What else has he got around here though? Oh, the way you go. Say cheese! It's just gonna be like me. We're in Oh, it came out kinda blurry. Well, that's okay. That gives a character. Hope you don't mind the photo. Of course we don't mind. I wanna see it! Oh, it's sure thing. We all look so cute! Uh, how's my hair? I wanna see! I wanna see! I am also here. Hello. Oh, hey Amori, did you want to look at the photo too? Oh, okay, that's pretty cute. That's pretty freaking cute. It's too bad that it came out kind of blurry, but you all still look so cute. I should add it to my collection. Yeah. Woohoo! Another shot for the photo album. Move over, Aubrey. I can't see. Hey, stop pushing. You already had your turn. Get out of my way, Kel! Uh, wait, uh, hold on. There's no need to fight. Me first! No, me! Stop it! You guys are knocking me over! Jesus! Guys, what are you doing? Uh, whoops. Oh my gosh. Basil, I'm so sorry. Are you okay, Basil? You two are in big trouble now. This is why the both of you need to learn how to get along. I'm sorry, we didn't mean it, Hero. Please don't tell Mari. It's okay, don't worry about it. Accidents happen. Photos went everywhere. Pick them up, you freaking monsters. Here, your, here's your photos. It doesn't look like any of them got damaged. Let's put them back in your photo album together. Thank you, Hero. Let's go inside my house first. Remember to wipe your feet before you come in. Yo, you two gotta learn to chill. You being, you being some real brats right now, all right? What a nice little home. This is cute. Comfortable looking bed. Yeah, I don't get to own one of those in white space. Fireplace, the fire is warm. Bunch of books, mostly about plant care. Bunch of potted plants and flowers. Basil loves taking care of things. Okay, that's probably gonna say that for all of them. Um, can I look at the nightstand? Nope. Well, I guess that's that. Um, do I wanna talk to you or look at the photo album? Let's talk to him first. Are you ready to put back the photos, Amori? No, not yet. No problem, I'll wait here until you're ready. Basil's photo album, his most precious belonging. All right, now I'm ready to put the photos back. Yay, let's get started. Hmm, darn. I don't think I remember the order of all these photos. Don't worry about a thing, Basil. Omori has a really good memory, so I'm sure we'll figure this out in no time. Oh, good God. All right, okay. Um, so, Q and W is, wait, Q and W does nothing for now, I see. Um, well, this one. Um, turn page, place, return. Oh, does it force me to put it here, I guess, then? I'm not actually, I thought I was gonna have an actual, like, puzzle, but no, okay, it just tells me where to put them. Got it, okay. That one goes there, and then the most recent one. Boom. Basil's memories, that's cute. There, good as new. Oh, the card shuffling sound. I'm 
I'm really sorry for pushing you over, Basil. Even though at least half of it was Kel's fault. Yeah, I promise to never fight with Aubrey ever again. Unless she starts at first. Don't worry about it. I know you only wanted to see my photo album. Thank you for helping me put it back together. Oh, one fell out. Hmm? That's strange. The photo must have been loose. Huh? What's this? Did I take this photo? Oh god, I don't like this. Something about it seems... so familiar. No. That, that can't be. Mari. Oh, oh, God bless. Okay, hold on. I needed a moment. <laughs> I need a moment after that. Okay. I actually shuddered. <laughs> that got me. That got me good. That got me good. All right. Okay, so... Mari's dead, right? Mari's gotta be dead. How else is it that she's teleporting around in her picnic? And everyone likes her so much. Mari, Mari is no longer around. And this is, we're all gonna be dealing with that trauma in different ways. Hey, hey there, hey there, Miwo. Not much to do around here, is there? True. Tissue box are wiping your sorrows away. I don't have a door to get out anymore, man. You booted up your laptop. What'd you like to do? Uh, let's, is there anything new in the journal? Looks about the same. Spent time in white space and Visited my friends. Everything was okay. Well, um, I would like to log off. Keep from the laptop or on your lap. It felt nice. Well, let's go to the sketchbook. Okay. Yep. I remember all these. I should take... Hold on, hold on. Let's take another look and make sure there's nothing weird going on with these. Now that we have a bit more context. Um... Hmm... Is that Amori in the bathtub? Or is that Mari? Oh, what if she like commits suicide or something? I'm just I'm just I'm just throwing all kinds of stuff out the window at this point because I don't I I don't have enough context. So I'm just spitballing. Yep, and then there's the piece of meat. Oh god bless. Um, I don't remember drawing you. Can you get out of my life? I would like to leave white space. I'm, I'm very much... Get away from me. Get away from me, you weirdo hand thing. I'll fucking stab you. I'll do it. I, I want to get out of here. I don't like this place anymore. Um, well, anything else? Doesn't appear to be the case. I mean, do I have to fight a hand? I'll fight a hand. I'll stab a hand. Do it. Nope, okay, they just yeet me back. I don't I don't get a chance to fight. Or is there? Are you looking for a way out? There always is one, but I don't like this. Really don't like this. Back to the sketchbook. Um okay. Laptop again. Maybe I need to stare at the screen, but first, let's look at the journal, make sure nothing weird. Everything seems to be the same. Okay, um, I would like to stare at the screen. Stared at the screen. What would you like to do? Um, log off, I guess. Okay, um, how about the light bulb? Hello. Pitch black inside. Can't see a thing. Waiting for something to happen? Well, what if I check out the hands again? Hello. Yeah, you yeet me back. Hmm. Well, let's go exploring white space, I suppose. Got a couple of hands hanging out, just doing hand things. Excuse you. Leave me alone. You are not allowed to come near me. You freak now! 
But if I just go straight up. Probably shouldn't be going in weird diagonals like that. That's how you get lost. Excuse you. Nope. No thank you. I have no desire to interact with you. Miwo, can you help me please? I'm very lost. What if I go to the tissue box? I haven't checked that out. Wiping your sorrows away. Well. Okay, what if we go straight right then? It appears that we still loop. Okay. Um, can I go to my menu? Oh god. I really don't want to... Mm. Okay. Okay. Um, God, I don't even know what to say on this. Uh, it sucks because from a video game's perspective, this is all I can do, right? But as a person, I really, really don't like this. I really don't like this. This, this does hit somewhat of a sore spot with me, truth be told. Um, this is a sensitive topic. And I'm starting to understand that now. Um, is I really don't like the implication that this is your only way out, right? Like, it's... It never is, but I understand when it feels like it is. So... Yeah. Yeah. Don't show me. No. I don't want to see it. Oh my god, dude. Oh, okay. Look at all of us. Is that Basil? Yeah. There are all of our memories together. They're a little sad now. We should be happy that they happened at all. I mean, yeah, but that's a really... Mm, that's a very hard line of thinking. Let's make some new memories together, okay? Whew, okay. Where are you gonna where are you gonna put me out at? You see a boy sleeping in his room. What's his name? Um hmm. Can I name him Amori? Am I allowed to do that? Normally I go with default names for stuff like this because, you know, I don't know, it's just easier that way. What if I just go... Because he kind of looked like a Mori. You know what? No, 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 no. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go weird with it. We'll, we'll stick with Sunny. Boy's name is Sunny? Yes. Okay. Oh. Table lamp. Oh my god, you're... Okay, so you're Omori before... Oh, we have actual money now. We're in the real world. Hey, Sunny, it's Mommy. I'm still in the city setting things up for our new home. But did you finish packing yet? The movers are gonna be at our house in a few days, so I left a list of things for you to do before they arrive. Also, sorry, mommy messed up. I forgot to tell you the electric company that we need a few, I forgot to tell the electric company that we need a few days before we're ready to move, so the lights might be cut out sometime tonight. Anyway, I know moving to a new place can be a little nerve wracking right now, but I think a change of scenery will be positive for both of us. I know you haven't talked to anyone in a while, but you might wanna say goodbye to your old friends before we leave. Kel has been trying really hard to get a hold of you ever since we put our house up for sale. 
He's been calling us every week for the past few months. He seems a little lonely. Maybe you should pay him a visit. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Bzz. Oh, God. You are hungry. An old computer. Bunch of books. Cardboard boxes littered across the house. Table lamp. Got a wardrobe. An ordinary houseplant. Nothing special about it. Cardboard boxes. More boxes. More boxes. What is this? Mom's to-do list. You don't feel like doing your chores right now. Yeah, that's fair. More boxes. What are these rocks? Oh, some family photos. I'm really not digging this dorkness. Not a fan. One of two old grandfather clocks. They stopped working a long time ago, but mom likes to keep them around. This mom's room, I take it? An empty picnic basket. This is not mom's room. This is Mari's room. Would you like to save? Yeah, I would like to save. Bookcase has been cleared out. Barber boxes are lured across the house. Mom's bed. No, it is mom's room. The mattress is too hard for you to sleep comfortably. I think I see where this is going. I'm very glad I did not put, like, my name in for this character. Um, I don't think I can handle that, truth be told. Oh, yikes. Um, got a bathroom. Bathtub. Oh, no. Is anything going to happen? Any weird monsters? Nope. Okay. Some towels and toiletries. And a toilet. All right, well, are you sure you want to go downstairs? I guess. Oh, I don't like this. Nope. Can't do it. He's just, he, he can't do it. You don't want to look down. Okay, um, what if I go back to the bathroom then? Oh, there's something on the mirror now. Hi, Sonny, this is a note from Mommy. Remember to brush your teeth every day. Love you, XOXO. Yeah, it do be me though. Okay, um, hmm. Alrighty then, well, back to my room, I guess. Can I just go back to bed? Very comfortable bed, would you like to sleep? No, not yet. I wanna check everything else out though. No new messages. I guess I just go back to sleep. Some family photos. Hmm, yeah, well, back to bed we go, I guess. Oh boy. I was not aware how heavy this game was gonna be. <laughs> I apologize. Um, I'm glad I put some sort of disclaimer at the beginning. I thought there was going to be some light sub themes, not, we're just real in there, brother. Oh, okay. I have woken back up now. I mean, what, do I do my chores now? Oh, God. Door, door be locked. What about this door, though? Yep. What if I go downstairs and not out to the red horribleness? Oh my god, why is our second story so freaking high? Well... Oh, I can't, I can't move? Can't move my body? Oh, I can only go down. Oh no. Can we not? I, I regret this greatly. I would like to go the other direction. Yeah, no, I don't blame you. You are hungry. Can I not? Can I go up? Nope. You are hungry. Mm. Yeah, go, go back up. Go back up where it's safe. While we still can, please. I understand that I am hungry. I would like to leave. Very hungry, dude. 
Nope, down's the only, oh my god, not again. No. Not again, though. Oh my god. Oh, that one's way worse. Holy hell. No, I don't want to go back up anymore. <laughs> oh, it's coming. Well. Okay. Yep. Um. Yeah, afraid? That's very fair. What will Sunny do? Fight? What skills do I have? None. A attack something. Something shoves Sunny. Yep. Sunny's attack did nothing. Uh, run! Not allowed to run. Well. That's all I got, I guess. Okay. Well, the something's gonna kill me. It's gonna turn me into toast. Sunny. Something taunts Sunny. As he falls. Taunts him as he falls. Okay. Take a deep breath. Don't be afraid. It's not as scary as you think. You steady yourself and remember how to calm down. Removes emotions and heals some heart. Yo, that's pretty pretty good. Calm down. It's 40 heart, damn. Neutral. Now that I've got a clear head, you stand no chance, you horrible monster. Monster has never, never existed. You got a first aid kit. Can I go back upstairs? Nope, you are very hungry. Nope, not feeling that either. Well, I guess we leave. <laughs> guess we're leaving. Oh no, okay, I thought that was like out of the house. No, no, I, I refuse. I refuse though. You can't make me. You just you you can't. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna play the game by your rules. Mm, can I leave? Can I go to like go get some late night McDonald's? Nope. All right. Uh, fridge first. Looked in the fridge and find cold steak. Take it. Yes. You got cold steak. You should probably heat it up before you eat it. You put the cold steak in the microwave. Dude, this is making me hungry, no lie. <laughs> Got microwave steak. I would like to eat the microwave steak. Horton? Microwave steak, your favorite food! I can't... Do I have to cut it? I don't want to pick up the knife. Uh, you pick up the steak knife. Ah, uh, yes. A lovely, well-done steak. Okay, look. I know, Sunny slash Amori, you're going through some rough times right now, okay? And I don't want to belittle that in any way, shape, form, or fashion. What the fuck are you doing, doing eating steaks well done, my guy? Bruh. Why you gotta, why you gotta ruin a good steak like that? How, would you like to eat some? Yes. I don't like this. I really don't like this. Okay. Still hungry, huh? Oh god, no, I'm very sick. Oof! Your stomach didn't agree with that. Alright, um, well I guess I'm going to the bathroom then. This door, right? I believe so. I'm gonna take a look at myself. Yeah, I do be very wavy. Um, little, little too much info, but that's all right. You threw up. 
Okay. Um, well. Uh. I've got a fucking knife. Good. I do have my steak knife. Hey, Sonny. It's Mari. I'm finally back home, but I forgot my keys. Could you open the door for me? Do not open the door. Do not open that door. Yeah, you turn around and you walk away. Where even am I? What would you like to do? Do nothing. Sonny, are you there? I'm... I'm cold. No, I did no. I'm sorry, you're dead. And there's nothing I can do to change that. I wonder what would happen if I had chosen to open the door, though. But you're not real. You're a figment of my imagination. I'm going back to bed. Very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Yes. Pow oh my god. I really don't like this. <laughs> Please stop. Okay. Do be my dark room, though. I want to go back to the fairy tale land. That was a very fun place. Whew. Welcome to White Space. You've been living here for as long as you can remember. Well, at least there's a way out now. Hey, Miwo. Anything new in the sketchbook? This is indeed a steak, my favorite food. Boot up your laptop. Oh. Um. Excuse you. Collect the keys to fill in the blanks. Incorrect keys will be discarded to the right. What? Amongst the other... Uh, what on earth? I would like to leave this. <laughs> um, press Q to open the hangman menu. You are hungry. Something fell nearby. Grass near the stump. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna find these. And this is where they're located and then I can fill it in. Okay. I would like to leave. White door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Nothing. Not allowed to leave yet. Something fell nearby, though. Hello, hands. Oh. You found a map! Yo, that's pretty sweet. And there are the keys. Zero out of 26. Okay. Press W to open the headspace map. I don't like the spider on the moon up there. I'm not a fan. It's like an underground area too. Dang. Now may I leave? I would very much like to leave white space. A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? I would like to open the door and exit white space. Thank you very much though. Have a lovely day. Oh, I didn't check out the light bulb. What if something different happened with the light bulb there, you fool? Here we go again. Hey guys. Mori, thank goodness you're here. Have you seen Basil? We can't find him anywhere. We should go tell Mari you're okay. She's been worried sick. Well. Away we go. Going out, Amori? Here's your allowance for today. 200 clams? Yo, wait a minute. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. 
Uh, I don't like that sound at all. 11 keys left. Okay, um, let's look in other places first. Instead of going straight to the playground to speak with my dead sister, question mark? I'm assuming she's my sister. She did say big sis. You should go see Mari. She's been so worried about you. Mm. I want to make sure there are no keys lying around, though. You don't understand. Up we go. Can we go back to having fun times at, like, the beach? When this was, like, a cute little game about, you know, nonsense and bullies and... Living in weird worlds. Afraid of drowning. Yeah, that's fair. What if I, what if we make, I want to build sandcastles with my friends. Yes, that is very much a thing I want to do. Oh my God, dude, Kel is going ham. Oh, you built a friggin' sand city. Holy shit, dude. Made a little, one of the little turnip guys. All right, well, that was lovely. Um, I guess I'm gonna go see Mari now, and she's gonna be like, why didn't you let me into the house, Amori? Why didn't you let me in? I froze to death because of your decision. Probably what's gonna happen. Maybe. But definitely, though. Uh, I know I'm afraid of spiders, but what if there's a key around here, though? Also, what's in the... Can I go to the hangman map? Yes. In grass near the stump. Okay, and the A's filled out, got it. So, oh, and I can see on a shredded old bridge between, between giant pinwheels. I only saw one giant pinwheel. I didn't see two. So I bet going up is where I'll find the next one in that like area over there. But for now, let's just keep going. I, I'll try and collect them if I can, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go super ham on it, at least on camera. Hi, Mari. Mori, you're okay. Oh. Don't worry me like that. Where's Basil? He's not with you, Amori? No. I'm afraid not. The last thing I remember was sorting photos with Basil in his house. Next thing I know, I'm waking up in neighbor's room with Aubrey and Kel. At least we found you, Amori. But I hope Basil is okay. Who's gonna protect him if we're not there? Don't be such a downer, Aubrey. We'll find Basil for sure. You're absolutely right, Kel. It's at times like these when we gotta stay positive. Hmm. Why don't we go back to Basil's house? There might be something that we missed. Uh, the photo? That's the spirit hero. As always, I'll be here if you need me. I would like to have a picnic with my friends. Thank you. I miss Basil already. You're not fooling me anymore, game. You can give me the happy music and whatnot, but I understand. I now know what you're up of, what, what you're all about, okay? I would like to save my game though. No longer in the prologue? No, we're still in the prologue, dang. So anyway, uh, this is where I'm gonna call the episode, back where I started the last one. <laughs> anyway, thank you again for watching. Um, as always, there is a link in the description to the Steam page if you wanna pick up the game for yourself. Um, if you do have psychological trouble at times, um, any of these issues that are explored in this game, just be aware of that. Just be aware of that if you're gonna pick this game up. And you know, maybe be aware if we're gonna keep watching this. Just just keep that in mind. Um, anyway, uh, thank you. Oh, whoops, wrong button, don't mind me. Thank you again for stopping by and watching, and I hope you have a great rest of your day and your night and your week and your weekend and whatever else it may be, and I will see you again next time. Thanks again, and bye bye